The final chapter of the 2023 Davis for Health Community Health Assessment, which starts on page 254, highlights the physical environment in Davis County. People interact with their physical environment through the air they breathe, the water they drink, the homes in which they live, and the transportation they use. In this chapter, you'll find sections on land use, hazardous waste, the housing environment, broadband, the food environment, transportation, air quality, and water quality. The physical environment has always been Davis County's lowest ranked health factor according to county health rankings and roadmaps, mainly due to air quality and commuting measures. The county is doing worse than Utah and the U.S. for grocery stores, supermarkets, and stores that accept and participate in federal food assistance programs like SNAP and WIC, traffic volume, commuting alone, and air pollution from particulate matter. Additionally, the Utah Healthy Places Index identified the physical environment factors of air pollution and park access as top policy opportunities for improving community conditions and health in Davis County. Strengths of Davis County related to its physical environment include many trails and facilities that support walking and biking, safe fluorinated water systems, and the majority of homes having broadband internet access. Emerging issues for Davis County includes water supply, especially related to the conservation of the Great Salt Lake, the growth of high density housing, and prevalence of fast food restaurants. You can find resources for transportation, water conservation, household waste, and clean air in the CHA. Stay tuned to learn more about the health of Davis County. You can access the CHA online at cha.davisforhealth.org. Please send us an email if you have any questions.